What's going on, everybody? Z here. Welcome back to some more No Man's Sky. So we just finished up with a live stream over on Twitch. It was a fantastic good time. If you missed it, don't worry. You can catch it live on my second channel, Z1 Gaming Late Night. I have a link down below. Um, and yes, it'll actually be there because I've been horrible about that. Anyways, what are we doing today? Ooh, today we are unlocking the living ship. I am so excited. Uh, I think we're unlocking it. I'm pretty sure there's only three steps. Uh, my inventory is completely full of grimy. There's a lot of stuff in here. So let's grab the neural stem, the heart, the hardened shell, and the awakened void egg. And let's go and do the thing. So what I'm actually going to do is I'm actually going to portal uh, somewhere else. I'm actually going to portal back to where I was because the uh, it seems like the ships there that are spawning are black and red. So I'm hoping maybe we'll get super lucky and maybe get our first one of black and red. I, I don't think it's going to happen, but I don't care. Uh, okay, so let's see. Where is my larval core base one? So we set up a base on a, uh, a larval core area so I can farm nanites because... Um, I was under the impression that the first, like you had to have 10,000 nanites to get your living ship, but I think that is every other living ship. So I think your first one's free. The rest of them, you have to have 10,000 nanites in order to get, and I don't have 10,000 nanites, but I do have like 3,700 now. Um, so yeah, but okay, let's, let's do this. Let's make this happen. Let's make this happen. Oh, I'm scared. I'm nervous. I'm like, so excited. Actually. I don't think they, let's see if they respond. I doubt it because like, I don't know what the heck's been going. Yeah, so they're not respond yet. I don't know. I don't know what the deal is, but that's okay. All right, let's do it. Let's get our living ship. Oh my gosh. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. So comment below. What color do you think the living ship is going to be before we get it? If you comment afterwards, that's cheating and you're cheating. But what color do you think it's going to be? I want it to be black and red. I don't think it's going to be black and red, but I want it to be black and red. So let's go ahead and let's get into this. Also, if you guys enjoyed the video, make sure you leave a like. If you're new here, maybe consider subscribing. Would appreciate the support. So let's get out of here. Also, um, so this is actually a paradise planet right here, by the way. <laughs> we, we found another paradise planet, but this one's actually a paradise planet. And there's no uh, there's no storms. So we might, I don't know. I don't know if we're going to move or not. I'll have to see. Um, now, another thing about this system, which is really weird, is that I am getting space anomalies like crazy like absolutely crazy so all right let's do this living ship come on better be the living ship yes perfect okay <laughs> oh i'm so excited oh uh, we perform the binding seek the components and like metal masters before you and yet you share a mind with the other iterations yet you do not converge perhaps you will understand except transmission each time uh, this being floods my ship with a beautiful song. I attempt to commit the commit the experience to memory uh, to recall it later. And yet it, when it fades from present, it fades entirely. All I have is navigation data. It's probably in a different system, isn't it? Ah, it is. Interstellar coordinates received. Okay. Darn, I was really hoping to be here. All righty. Where are you? Where are you at? Where is the living ship? Okay, where is it? Tab to skip. Where are you? Tell me where you are. The void egg sees the specific world. Examine the egg to learn its requirements. Fantastic. Uh, that was the wrong button. All right. What do you seek? Uh, when touch conscious of power with strange anomaly, one minute a world of grass, the next world of bizarre fungal growths. Are you kidding me? I'm going to go here. I'm just going to go here. What scan? What place is this? Uh-uh, you're not going to get me now. Mm -mm, no, sir. Okay, so this is not the planet because the Void Egg sees a specific world examine. Uh, oh, nope, this is the planet. Okay. Oh, gosh. Uh, the whole coordinate thing is terrible. I hate doing the coordinate thing. <laughs> All right, we need negative 10, negative 62. Actually, we're not that far off. So negative 10. We got to head north a little bit. And then negative 62. We need to head east. Okay, so we got to head northeast. All right, let's do this. Let's get close and let's see what happens. I hope it's only three. I'm really hoping today is the day that we get the uh, we get the new ship. All right, we're getting close. We're at negative 12, negative 66. So it's going to be here soon ish. I have 1166. Okay, so we need to go a little bit more east. 
Okay, we are like super close. I'm gonna go ahead and land here. 10, 3, 62, 1. We are here. The coordinates haven't fully cleared up though, but that's all right. What do we have? Oh, it's this thing. How did I miss this? How did I miss this? It's gotta be this thing right here. I actually don't know where to interact with it though. It's right here. Yes. Yes. Tree one process. Log follows. Biological shells and stable reddit converged mine data cannot be overloaded through this entire process. Multiple sites required distribution distributed biology to match distributed mind structure alignment appears necessary yet to centralize that i don't even know what it's saying right now uh I hold in my hand the life the heart body network but it is is it life the conversion to other minds it was a crux of an ancient experiment uh sees it oh no <sighs> i feel the life form i carry the egg the heart the skin the nerves i'll say as i sense the aurora machine where something's happening even though i cannot comprehend what it is what it must feel like i am fed another blueprint Another plan to follow. Once again, I must adapt my multi-tool to some new purpose. Fantastic. Okay. You know, I was wondering because I thought that we had another uh, another thing that we had to unlock. The a new... Oh, no. Don't tell me this is... Ugh. I'm going to be upset. I'm going to be upset. Install technology. Uh, no. Install technology. Uh, Install technology. Why would... Why? Okay, this thing. <laughs> uh, sodium nitrate. You know what? I have sodium in my backpack and we have a personal refiner and we're making sodium nitrate nice so uh okay how much did i need perfect done skis grab that grab that put that away and multi-tool this thing done skis gather fragmented kawea to seed to craft seeds of glass the void egg host requires a personal singularity of the anubis beam will Extract fragments of life from living beings. All right, so this is the fun part. Now we have to go around and shoot these living beings because these are living beings <laughs> and we have to take fragments of their life out of them. Doesn't sound great. Okay, we have it. The Void Hague, uh craft seed of singularity. Uh, can I put some of this in my cargo? Let's go in here. Let's craft this guy. Okay. Is this not, is this not, is there four parts? I really hope I don't have to wait 24 hours again. All right, come on, let's do this. Do not tell me it's gonna give me some immature thing that I have to uh, wait for it to mature. Growing singularity, a slow, oh my gosh. It is, I have to wait 19 hours. Yeah, you know what? I don't, I'm not really feeling that. I think we're gonna move, uh, I think we're gonna speed up the clock a little bit because that does not sound like a good time. I don't wanna wait, I'm done, I'm done waiting, that's it. <laughs> I'm done. I quit. No more waiting. Alrighty there. Look at that. Oh, hmm. Imagine this. Look at the, um, it's fully grown. Imagine that. All right. <laughs> let's get out of here and let's see what's going to happen, shall we? So basically what I did is I just, I went offline on everything and just changed the clock a day ahead. And uh, yeah, there we go. That's it. We're good. Actually, what did it say? Did it say I was humming a, a, a specific tune or something? Uh, okay, we already did that. All right, come on, living thing. Oh, pulse, gosh darn it. <laughs> pulse tension's out of juice. All right, let's try this again. Oh, oh. Yes, yes, there's the contact that I've been waiting for. Uh, okay. It is sacrificed, there's no infinite mind to spill. It must be yielded. Uh, strong saint, the, the song of the strange space creature has changed subtle, but unspeaking has become a duet. A perfect harmony with the void egg. Continue to listen. Uh, the voice of the alien is fading. It feels weaker and a perfect inverted echo. The void egg grows in volume. It's music now insistent pounding. It has its own message. The hunter, the reflection of the hunter, the spiral reality hunter over. Oh no. You know what? I'm pretty sure those are portal coordinates. So those are portal coordinates. And I can't go there because I don't have the portal glyphs unlocked yet. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Mm -mm -mm. That's not good. That's not good. I wonder if... Hold on a second. I wonder if I can find... Uh, examine the void again. Inventory learning requirements. Unconventional travel may be required. And I don't have those portal coordinates yet. Because <laughs> I don't have all the glyphs. You know what? I'm going to see. Let's get out of this view. I hate that view. It's terrible. <laughs> um, hmm. You know, part of me wonders if I had a portal, if I tried to use the portal, if it would even let me, because I don't think it will. 
I don't think it will let me because I don't have the glyphs learned yet. And we need, oh my gosh, we need so many glyphs. Okay, so I'm going to try to get some glyphs learned. Um, there's a couple ways to do it. If you follow the story, um, eventually you'll get to a point where every time you warp, you actually get a glyph. Or if you go to a space station and there's a traveler, you can talk to them. They'll give you coordinates to their um, to their gravesite. Uh, embrace the life form. Let's just embrace the life form. Embrace the life, but it's myself I embrace. Uh, ta -ta -ta. Oh, you didn't give me... You know the person says to offer ask where they came from. Ask where they came from. Oh my gosh, it's a hundred nanites. Ah, <sighs> okay. Directions to a place of interest. Okay, so this is how you can find portal glyphs. And there's 16 that you need. And I think I have like two or three right now. So uh let's let's see. Let's see if this is this is how this is gonna work. Oh, this is actually kind of a cool planet. It's got like it's got like lava shrooms or something on it. I don't know. All right, so here is the here's a glyph. Hello, dude. Questions. It was simple. Sentinels. They're sentinels. Where do they come from? Made it uh, my life's work to find. Left logs, records, access worlds. Uh, marked by glyph. Extract glyph. This is what? Maybe two of two of sixteen. <laughs> uh, leave the fallen traveler in peace. Two of sixteen. Okay. So. I have to go through and I have to unlock absolutely every single one of these. What are these things? These things are kind of cool looking. Now, it's not that bad to do. Um, because literally all I just have to go to Space Station, find a Traveler, and then go, uh, go to that Traveler's Grave. So the worst part, I guess, is probably the 1600 nanites or the, that I'm going to need. Well, the 100 per deal. But in the process, I will actually be able to upgrade my, uh, my cargo because if I go to... Uh, Oh gosh, I gotta go to 14 systems. I gotta I gotta go to at least 14 systems because not every system has a traveler. I mean, it's not bad as far as hyperdrive stuff goes because like we have the antimatter thing. So uh, actually, you know what? I'm gonna call in the Nexus. I'm gonna grab my upgrade and then I'm gonna go to the next place. So on and so forth. Come on, space station. Have a traveler. Is there a traveler over there? I can't tell. It doesn't really look like it. No. God, we can't wait. And there's no traveler here either. <laughs> I just need one more. I'm pretty sure I just need one more. I think it's just one. And then I think we're done. And I don't have to do this anymore. I mean, I guess we can get another backpack upgrade. Woohoo. Big fantastic. Okay, so once again, I need more fuel. Uh, oh, I didn't leave it going. Okay, we gotta wait for the antimatter to go. And while we wait, I guess I'll go ahead and make a couple more of these canisters. Fantastic. Uh, let's go ahead and put these in cargo. Okay, so now we just basically wait for the antimatter reactor to make its antimatter. <laughs> Darn it. This is the worst ever. You know, I'm going to tell you right now, don't do this. Just do the story. Because I, I think if I would have just did the story and played that, I think I would have probably already been done. Oh, I like that. I like that uh, that ship. Kind of looked neat. Okay. Um. Yep. Back to waiting. Oh, my gosh there's a traveler in this station i just i <laughs> i made two warp drives because i was like okay i'm just gonna warp around and wait while the other ones are getting made so i just went to a random station that i've already been to and apparently i didn't check this one because we got a traveler all right so you should be my last buddy come on let's do this uh bargain for information uh-huh yep 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 okay cool cool Talk to you again. Yes, 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 yes. All this stuff. 100 nanites. Thank you so much. Offers direction to place of interest. Awesome. Okay, let's get this done, shall we? I am so sick. I'm done. I'm done with this. <laughs> I am not having fun getting these signals. You know, you might actually be able to use maps too, now that I think about it. Hmm. Hmm. I wonder if I should have tried using maps from the cartographers. I don't know, and I don't care. Ooh, this planet has salvageable scrap on it, too. That's fancy. Expanding the base place. Construction terminal. Wait, how did I get that? I don't remember how I don't remember how I unlocked that. Oh, here we go. Now I also have to find a portal. After I find this one, <laughs> then I have to also find a portal. So uh that will definitely be with maps. Okay. 
Yep, yep, yep. Uh huh. I know you're talking about this stuff. Sentinels, all that fun stuff. The Atlas, extract the glyph. Uh, travel to unknown worlds. Leave the traveler in peace. 16 of 16. Thank God. Oh my God. That is so nice. All right, now I need to find a port. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> we got <laughs> we we got another monolith here. Let's see what we got here. Destination reached. Okay. Mm-hmm. 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 Yep. Yes. Step back in the past. Resi Let's just step back in the past. Let's do it. What are we going to learn? No, it's health restored. You've learned the word for infinite. But I don't think I can actually... Okay. Can I interact with this anymore? No. Darn it. Oh my goodness. This is... This is a horrible, terrible, awful disaster. Oh. Can I use this again? Oh! <gasps> okay, portal. Yes! 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 We can find a portal. I'm so happy about that. Uh, portal. Arrive in 18 hours. Oh my gosh. You know what? I'm going to put a base on this one and never forget it. Because this was terrible. So the hunter is this. Which is, which is what I did. Oh. This is the reflection? How is that one the reflection? That doesn't make any sense. Okay, and then this is the the spiral of reality. And then star of a water is that one. Okay, I had that right. The ascending orb, which was that one. The obscured companion. This is the obscured companion. Okay. Sure. Hunter. And then everything else. Okay, everything else we got right. Ta-da! Okay, there we go. I don't know what the deal was. That's weird. That's really weird. Like, I, I figured I had it right. Okay, let's do this. Let's go. Let's go get our living ship. It's only been like hours upon hours in the making. <laughs> this is taking forever. All right, living ship, I'm coming for you once we load in. All right, we've arrived. Uh, I'm not trying to install that. I'm trying to do the uh, trying to do the things with the egg. Okay, what does the egg want? Egg? Uh-huh. Okay, I'm here. Okay, I don't really want this being tracked right now. I want this one being tracked. Okay. Uh, negative 56, 75, 80. Oh my gosh, it's moving a lot. Okay, we're gonna have to get into here. Oh God, we have to do this again? 56. Oh, we're already here. 50, 55, 56. We're like super close. We're like super close. Oh, there's actually a marking for it right here. Void egg frequency coordinates. Oh, it looks like somebody built a base here. All right, let's land. We'll, we'll use this this friendly landing pad. Did they plant trees and stuff here? Oh my gosh, they did. Oh my gosh, talk about like... What the heck? What the heck is this? This is... <laughs> this is so funny. I love it, Forgotten Terminal. Uh, let's go ahead and just get rid of the goop. Fragments of a fallen traveler. Signal is recording a, a loop by a strange device. Lodge in the terminal envelope. Collect vessel. Rare soul chamber. Oh my god. What? Acquire archive souls for the egg host? I have to... What do I do with it? Void egg demands you to fill the soul chamber. Search for fallen travelers? What? Okay, I guess we uh, had to go here. Is Please tell me that there's... Is there a fallen... That's the portal. Uh, resource outpost pure fairy. Tell me there's a fallen traveler something or other. Do I seriously have to get to those coordinates myself? Point plus four and plus 173? Oh my gosh. Okay, we're close enough to 173. We need to get back to positive four. Okay, so it looks like I'm basically here. So it's right here somewhere. Uh, I just gotta figure out where. Oh, there you are. Thank goodness. Whew. Come here, bud. I need ya. Yep, collect soul. All right. Uh, <laughs> that's one of three. <laughs> Darn it. Negative 45, negative 47. You've gotta be kidding me. All right, you know what? This guy's base is built on a grave. It's not the one that I'm supposed to be going to, but I'm gonna try to see if I can just use this one as one of them. You know what I mean? Uh, do you have a way? 
in and out. Okay, so we can go down. What the heck? Oh, forget this. I'm just going to jump off the edge. Okay, let's see what happens here. Collect soul. Hey, it totally worked. I can just grab whichever ones I need. Heck yes. Okay, we're going to go find another one that has the their thing marked like that. Oh, that's super handy. Uh, I can't get up there, though. I have found the final grave. And it took absolutely forever. <laughs> Collect the soul. 100%. We're good. All right. Acquired archive souls for the egg host. Let's make this happen. Finally. I hope. Uh, so archive complete. Return to your own reality via the portal. All right. That sounds like, and you know, I think I'll do just that. All right. We're back on our own planet. Well, we're back in our own, uh, own system, I guess. But now what does it want me to do? Await oh, contact. Okay. So what I kind of want to do is I kind of want to go to my base place before we do this, because I think this is the point in which we actually get the stuff. I think, I think this is it. Um, so let's do this. We're going to hop in the Nexus. I'm going to go back to my, uh, forgive our invasion of your personal interface. We are dying. Our body's old, failing. Our minds, uh, unravels. We must be renewed. We must be restored as the way it has always been. Refresh us, reset us, rebirth. What you have made hatch one right here, right now. A set of coordinates are bringing to my navigation computer. Oh my God. Oh, finally locate the new life form. I will absolutely do just that. Where is it at? Where is it? It's in a different system, isn't it? Locate the fallen host. You know, the first one might just be set. It might just be set where it's at because the, those portal coordinates are the same for everyone. Um. Okay, so where are we going here? It's on this planet. Oh my gosh, it is finally time. It's finally time. Remember, comment, what color do you think the uh, thing's gonna be? It's probably gonna be the same color because if it's the same thing that, I don't know. I mean, I guess I kind of went, I, I did go through a different portal this time, but still, I have no idea. Oh my gosh, I am so excited. This took way longer than I was anticipating. What the heck? I just put 200 in there. But yes, comment, what color do you think it's gonna be before I before we see it? Oh, I'm so excited. I am so excited for this. All right, fallen host, I am ready to claim you. You shall become mine. We shall become one. You know, I don't really remember it being this much work to get this ship. <laughs> like, I d the first one is terrible. <laughs> like, this is awful. Never again would I ever want to do this. All right, what do we got? It's going to be like a nasty yellow color, isn't it? Oh my God, it is. It looks like snot. It's like the grossest of the colors. You know, I feel like this is the same color my first living ship was. <laughs> I really do. It's such a weird color. All right, that's fine. I'll take it. Yep, the starship, the creature, the shell lies next to me. Lights pulse across its surface, but it's still quiet. Begin the biogenesis. One mutate, uh, mature heart node, uh, mature neural stem. Ship quivers in response, suddenly aware of my touch. Unhardened shell. I feel the machinery solidify beneath my hands. It's flesh taking form as living being continue biogenesis one singularity core this ship is complete my task is not yet complete it needs something more the archive soul it is done it is alive it took forever but we finally did it we finally got our new ship look at you aren't you just beautiful it's a very interesting color actually it has like a, it's kind of like, it's got like a little mohawk deal on it. I like it. All right. Not bad. S class, you know, um, uh, of course I'm going to compare and I'm going to claim, uh, like, duh, no way I wouldn't claim it. Um, okay. Hold on. Yeah. Let's just claim it. Ta -ta. Oh my gosh. We have done. Oh God. That's disgusting. Yep. I don't like the interior of this thing whatsoever. No, thank you. I will uh, politely go to the external view. Oh, thank you much. Oh, we've done it. We have finally claimed our ship. It is beautiful <laughs> in the fact that it's a living ship. <laughs> it's beautiful in that sense. All right, uh, let's get out of here. Let's go back to our base place. And let's, uh, let's get it out of that planet. That planet's nasty. 
you know, now it looks a little bit more blue and like not as bad. <laughs> it looks pretty good. Oh, we've done it. Okay. I want to get back to, uh, I want to get back to my base. So we, now, since we have portal coordinates, I can't, we can go and get whatever ship we want. However, I need 10,000 nanites to claim another living ship. We already have the egg. Uh, and it's, it's such a, it's so much easier now that we've already done this. Um, but we still have to have those nanites and I'm just going to head back to my, uh, my nanite farm and I'm going to be working on that because I want to get the ship that I want. I want to get the black and red living ship. The one that I am waiting for, uh, Larva core base warp there. Fantastic. But that is going to end this episode. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. If you did, make sure you leave a like. If you're new here, don't forget to subscribe as well for some more. Um, we're not quite done yet though. Hold on. But, uh, we're going to talk about some living ship stuff. But yes, oh my gosh, that took so much longer. So I would recommend before you go out and do this, uh, continue the story because at one point you will hit a, uh, you'll hit a spot where you start unlocking glyphs every time you teleport. I feel like that would have been faster. Uh, and then the whole, like locating the things, um, we are capable of, uh, of warping through space, but we can't have a GPS on a planet. I think we need a GPS on the planet. When we get portal, when we get coordinates to go to this X, Y spot or whatever, we should be able to just mark it and we should be able to go there. That whole flying thing while, while looking at those numbers is the worst thing ever. I just want to say that. All right. So we are here. There's the living ship. Oh, it doesn't look too bad. It doesn't look too bad. It's not bad at all. Okay. Now, uh, let's see. What are the odds that the cores are? What the heck? Huh? I've never had this issue with these things. Usually they, they just re they just repopulate. I might have to take down all the walls and just see if that fixes it. Mm, darn it. I'm not really looking forward to that, but that, like I said, is going to end it. Now, as far as upgrades go for this, basically what we have to do is we fly through space and we come across these, uh, these essentially gigantic void eggs. You break them open and then they give you a, um, an upgrade module for your, uh, for your ship. So, um, that is. That is how you get upgrades and you have to upgrade those by using nanites. So like I said, I really got to get this thing going up and running. But yes, thank you again for coming out. If you commented like a nasty green color in the comments, you won. <laughs> you you win the pick. I don't know. You don't win anything. You win brownie points. Congratulations. They have no real world value. <laughs> but yes, thank you again for coming out. Have a fantastic rest of your day and I will see you in the next one.